What's going on, people? It's your boy Antonio. You know how we get down. Antonio Johnson, 112. Shout out to the Bitman community. That's how we're doing it. We run shit. And like you said, what we do, we keep delivering and keeping these chicks shivering. <laughs> That's what we do. We go in all night. So, boys, obviously, like and subscribe. Let me just reiterate to the new viewers, this is literally for do for single dudes. If you're starting to date or you're thinking about dating, before you started dating or you're thinking about dating or you are dating. It's not about if you've got a wife or you've got a long-term girlfriend. I can't really help you with that shit. This is just for uh, starting dating and you're out there dating. So, boys, today's subject, it's on the box. It's on. It's on the title. So, obviously... Why didn't she text back? <laughs> Listen, this has happened to everybody. It's happened to everybody. It's happened to me. I put my hands up. It's happened to my boy DK, the author. He's the he's the goat, the author of all of this. It's happened to everybody. Is when a chick doesn't text back. So, this is what I want to say to you guys. Like, don't let shit like that knock your confidence. I've seen it knock your knock everyone's confidence. You get someone, you get a chick's number, you text it, and you don't hear anything back. You will say to your boy, "Oh, yo, 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 I got, I got such and such's number the other day," and then you text it, and he'll go, "Oh, what, what happened then? Uh, I've heard nothing back," and, and it knocks your confidence. You could have met the woman of your dreams, and you got her number, and she doesn't text back. It's what it's what happens, boys. It is what it is. So. I'm here to run through some scenarios of why that's happened, okay? <laughs> first things first. First things first. If you've gone out, you you got, I don't know, let's let's go for the different scenarios. If you're in England, you got pissed, you got waved. If you're in America, you got lit, you got crunt. Uh, you got asked out, I don't know, I can't, there's too many. Basically, you got drunk. You drank too much. You drank too much, yeah? So then, A... You've taken the wrong number. She's told you what the number is, but because you've had too much to drink, you've taken the wrong number, and then now you ain't talking to anyone. They ain't shit. <laughs> You're talking to an invalid number, okay? Because you've had too much to drink, okay? So there's that one. That's that's the most common one. You've taken the wrong number, and that's it. Um, B. She just wasn't feeling you, bruh. Let's keep it real. Let's keep it real. Listen, we're bit men. We can take it. We can take it, okay? We can take it like Batman. We can take that shit. They're going to come for you. They're going to hunt you down. You can take it, the Dark Knight. But we can take it. She just wasn't feeling you, bro. She just wasn't feeling you. It is what it is. You can't get every single girl you want. You can't. No matter how how you how good you smell, no matter if you even if you followed every single video I've given you to a T, you still sometimes might not be able to get the, the person you want. It just doesn't happen. But the majority, you should be fine. But sometimes we don't. It doesn't work out. She just wasn't feeling you, bruh. So she's giving you the wrong number. You don't get the number. Another one, another reason. I'm just giving, I'm just giving you the most common. Like I said before in a previous video, depending on what time you get the, vid, the number. Say, for instance, you've gone out at 9 o'clock or 10 o'clock. At half 10, you've got the girl's digits. Yeah, and that's it. You didn't text her or anything, and then you text her the next day or the day after. That's a, that's like forty eight hours. Okay, you don't know what's happened in forty eight hours. In forty eight hours, she could have left you, gone to another bar, met a guy, he wrapped it up. It's a wrap. You know what I mean? He could have gone home with her, or pff, he just got a number and they started making out. He's kissing it. It's a wrap. Basically, it's a wrap. So there's that factor. So I would suggest if you get someone's number, probably try and text them through the night to find out where they are and like what bar they're in. Just try to get some communication there. But that's what could happen. She could have got someone else and that's that. Um, there's other things, there's other things. Because basically, boys, I see this all the time, is dudes get numbers and they don't hear anything. And they're like, oh, what, why, did she, why is she messing me back, man? What's going on, man? Listen, there's, there's so many fucking reasons. There's and there's the two other main reasons as well. There's three main reasons, other main reasons. She's not ready to date. She might have came out of a fucked up situation that's fucked her head up, 
and she's not ready to date. But she just gave you the number just to keep you happy. But she doesn't want to run a date anyone. Okay. B, another dude who she's been seeing previously is now fucking her head up and trying to get back with her. That dude probably is with other chicks, but his other chicks has fallen out. He's fallen by the wayside. He needs to go back to his old chick and he's trying to get, trying to get it back. Or it could be an ex-boyfriend. An ex-boyfriend wants to get back with her. They had something good and he wants, wants her back now because, like I said, he might have got another chick, but it didn't work out. So he's back to get her. This shit is real. This shit can happen. Or she could just have some fucked up shit going on in her life. Family issues, whatever. You know what I mean? It could be loads of reasons, but I've just given you boys a few reasons why she didn't text back. What do you do when it happens? Listen, boys, don't waste your fucking time, okay? If she doesn't text back, you've, you've messaged on a Sunday. You've got the number on Friday. You messaged her Saturday or, or Friday, or Sunday, sorry. She hasn't, you haven't heard anything. Leave it until at least Wednesday. Then message it again. That probably If you're going to do it one more time, Friday, Friday, the weekend, hopefully she may text you back, she might be like, okay, I'm bored, I want to do something, it's the weekend, she may text you back, if you don't hear anything on Friday, fucking leave it, don't, don't stress it anymore, just leave it, just leave it, and what I would say to you, don't delete the number, just delete the message you sent, just delete the message, because what will happen is you never know when she might come back, and then, bingo, so boys, that's my two cents on why she didn't text back. Don't let it knock your confidence is the first thing. Don't ever let it knock your confidence. If she doesn't text back, that's on her. You get me? Because we're too, that means we're too good. She ain't ready for us, bruh. She ain't ready for us. We're too good for her. You know what I mean? She's missing out. You're not missing out. Okay, boys? It's your homie. No matter where you are in the world watching this, you are my homie. We're a bit, man. We're the best out there. I'm out. Antonio Johnson, like, subscribe, comment, and like I say, if you want to contact me directly, I always get back as much as I can, and I'll get back to you. Okay, talk to me.